How's it going, crew? This is Happy Days, and welcome back to our Felix the Fisherman Fisherman's Challenge. Last episode was a big one. We fought the Queen Bee and almost died because I forgot to put my buffs on. <laughs> buffs and helmets, I tell you. I just can't seem to remember them. And uh, we made our way to the dungeon and set up our amazing fishing farm that hopefully is going to get us a bunch of dungeon crates. <gasps> Golden Squirrel! <laughs> that hopefully gets us a bunch of dungeon crates so we can get a cobalt shield and all those other awesome weapons. So lots to do this episode, we're gonna do some fishing, do some quests, maybe make our way to the underworld and start getting ready for the wall of flesh. Possibly need to find some uh, life crystals as well because our health is a little bit low. So lots to do guys, let's get started. Let's start our fishing day, as always, by checking for our daily quest. Let's see. Ooh, ooh, I think I've done this one before. Fallen starfish. Whoa. Should I actually go and fish one up, or should I just grab one out of the chest? Oh, guys. Well, I did say I wanted to keep extras, so... Yeah, yeah, no, nah, I think we'll go for a quick fly through the sky. Oh, and it, uh, it's a chance to use gravitation potion as well. Ooh, 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 and I could try and get some stuff while I'm up there. Maybe a sky crate. Oh my gosh. Maybe I should do this quickly. It's probably a good idea. I mean, I think we've got a... Yeah, there's a sky lake just there. So, okay, I'll skip ahead just to the, um, the, uh, <laughs> the island part because I know flying's not the best thing to watch. Here we are in our safety box, the anti-harpy 3000. It is guaranteed to defend against harpies as long as they don't come from this angle. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's catch some uh, of the fallen starfish, which will be nice. Yeah, hi Harpy. What's the matter? Can't get at me? Whoa! I'd laugh if it like hoiked in or something. I know there's no hoiks there, but uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, poor Harpy. What you gonna do? Yeah, you too, crazy Harpies. What's wrong with this? Come on, fish! Jump out of the water! Yes. Oh no! No, oh, the harpy, what did I call it? Ah, oh, no! The system is failing! Ah! Minotaur, save me! Save me! <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna just get the quest fish. I don't think we'll go for crates just yet, because I'm going to the dungeon for crates, so... Let's not, let's not have an overload of crates here. I'll drive myself crazy. Oh, uh, crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's too many harpies. <laughs> Well, the anti-harpy system worked pretty well. I ended up getting three more starfish, so I'll put two more in the box. And that way, if I get the same quest again, we won't even have to go and do it, which is awesome. <gasps> what are we going to get? Three, two, one, boom! Fishing potions, sweet. Um, that's actually a good thing. We're going to need them. We need crate potions. We need everything because we are heading to the dungeon now. What a basket! Oh, basket everywhere. <laughs> we are going to the dungeon to fish up some of these amazing crates. Let's go! Alrighty, here we are, back at the special fishing spot in the dungeon, ready to catch our amazing crates. Oh, oh, specular fish drop here, sweet! I can finally make some more recalls. Oh, this is so good. Oh, oh man. <laughs> I was like, well, we need to go exploring, but I didn't want to go just to get specular fish, so... It looks like I'm going to have recalls for days after this. So what we're going to do, so the mobs will fill up as, oh my gosh, I'm a fish too, this is so good. Wow. Um, yeah, so we're just going to catch lots of fish. I'm probably going to be fishing for a while here. Um, so I'll keep it recording if anything interesting drops. Uh, like if we get lucky and get a Zephyr fish or anything like that. Um, but yeah, apart from that guys, yeah, just hopefully get some crates sooner rather than later. And I'm going to wait to use my potions until it's pretty much all angry bones in there. Okay, so it looks like there's enough of them in there now. So the time has come to use some of our amazing potions and try and get some really good stuff. We caught a golden carp, which was really cool. And uh, one of them dropped a tally, but I can't use that. Um, but we might get a tally out of a chest. I, can you get them out of a dungeon chest? 
I don't know. No, I don't think so. Anyway, guys, I'll speed this up. Uh, hopefully, we get some really cool stuff. And let's do this. Oh, another golden crate. This is good. This is good. Oh, guys, we're doing pretty good so far. Uh, I've been fishing for probably, oh, I don't know, probably about 15 minutes, maybe 20. And uh, we've got quite a few crates. We've got one. Oh, yay, another rockfish. Awesome. Uh, looks like a pretty good melee weapon. And it's also a hammer. I think we're getting underground uh, level fishing drops as well, or cavern layer, uh, which is pretty cool. We've got one dungeon crate, just one, uh, which is a bit scary because, unfortunately, dungeon crates only have a 16% chance of dropping the locked box. So even if we open it, we're unlikely to get the stuff anyway, uh, which is a bit of a shame. So I'm probably not going to stay here forever. Um, I might just have to resign myself to the fact we may not get a cobalt shield this playthrough, but I'm still going to try. We've still got plenty of bait left. Uh, let's give this a good go. I might get some more bait, who knows, um, because I'm actually quite enjoying myself here. we still got a few potions as well, so uh, we'll keep going and see what we can catch. Okay guys, I am officially out of bait and out of patience for fishing, um, but it's been a big session. Uh, what was cool is we got the balloon puffer fish, uh, which makes you jump higher. I've never really used this, this before. And uh, we got lots of rock fish, uh, lots of other fish, golden carps, but most importantly, lots of beautiful crates. And the wiki says that the biome crates are about the same as golden crates, but I don't know, I seem to get a few more of those, so maybe they're between iron and gold. But uh, anyway, so that's it for the fishing. Now comes the fun part. Let's kill all the bangry bones with the boomstick. Oh yes, thanks for your time, fellas. Thanks to the good... <laughs> They've been making funny noises the whole time. And now, they all have to die. <laughs> oh, we might get a golden key if we're lucky too. Oh, yes. Uh, uh, and one more. And they're all dead. Alright, so I'm going to make my way back to base. We should be able to make uh, recoil potions now. So, yeah, we don't really need to keep this, do we? Uh, we probably should take the pig. And do I need anything else here? No, not really. Uh, so let's make our way back to base. And what I'm going to do, guys, let's sort our inventory. And then we'll open our beautiful dungeon crates. Can't wait. Okay, guys. So I'll spend some time organizing some of our new loot into different boxes here, different chests. I'll put the quest fish in a different box uh, because we're starting to get quite a lot of them. And a box called fish. And it's got fish in it. But it's also got crates, so maybe I should rename it. <laughs> but we'll save these crates for hard mode now. Um, because, yeah, we want to get those hard mode ores straight away. Although we are going to open our dungeon crates. Uh, because hopefully we get some useful stuff straight away. Alright, so golden luck boxes is what we're looking for. They're not guaranteed, but we have five crates, so we might get lucky. Alright, you ready? Three, two, one. Boom! <gasps> yes, we got one straight away. Awesome, so good. Okay, are we going to get any more? Oh, okay, we've got some master pause bait. Oh, this is so nerve-wracking. 
Oh yes, we got another one. <gasps> this is so good. Oh, we got some platinum. We can make. We can finally make some armor. Oh man. Okay. Okay. Mining potions. Good stuff. All right. Last one. This would be so crazy odds if we get a third one. But you never know. Let's go. Oh. Okay. No. Just lead bars. But we got two. Two golden lock boxes and lots of lots of good stuff actually. All right. So we're gonna open these up now. We get a rare item from the dungeon chest. Hopefully we get something we can use for our adventure. You ready? Three, two, one, let's open it up. Boom! Oh my god! Oh my god! We got one. We got a cobalt shield. Oh no way. Felix, the defensive fisherman now. <laughs> Bunnies, you don't stand a chance against Felix. <laughs> oh man, that's so good. Wow, that's gonna help so much. Oh, I don't know, should I have the vanity on for that? I don't know, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Should we use our cobalt vanity? Oh wow. <laughs> I noticed we can jump ridiculously high now with the um, balloon puffer fish and the frog leg. But, let's not get distracted, we might still get a good weapon. Oh man, I'm so nervous. Hopefully we don't get another cobalt shield. <laughs> Three, two, one, boom! <gasps> no way! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh yeah! Oh, Felix, the godlike fisherman. Wow. You, the Miramasa, I can't believe it. No way. <laughs> That is insane! Wow! Oh my god. And can I just say, thank goodness, I did not want to have to go fishing again. Not for that. Not for crates in the dungeon. Like, it took me probably... I don't know, I was probably there for an hour, I reckon. Like, it takes so long. <laughs> I don't know, what was the... The sped up segment was like a minute or so, and then yeah. Real time, one hour. But guys, we are powered up now. We've got the Miramaza, we've got the Cobalt Shield. We are ready for action. Oh my god. And, and we can actually make some armor and stuff, which is cool. Wait for the new day. We're going to go spelunking. We need some more health. So much to do, guys. Oh, I'm so excited. This is amazing. Okay, guys. It's a bright new day. And we're going to go spelunking. Hopefully find some good stuff. Man, I need to organize my potion chest. Uh, it's such a mess. I'm normally so neat with my potions. I don't know. Anyway, let's get some night hours. Let's get some mining potions. We've got plenty of bombs. This is this is ready to go. So we'll make our way back under the ground and let's look for life crystals. Okay, so we've made our way sort of underground to... Oh, Merchant must have died. Poor Merchant. Uh, I've just noticed some orange blood root and apparently that's pretty rare stuff. So yeah, I've made our way underground to kind of where we were. Um, well, this is as far as we've explored under the ground. Um, because we haven't done as much spelunking and you tend not to in a fisherman's playthrough. It's more just about fishing, obviously. Um, but what we're gonna do is, I don't know, just have a bit of a look around. Okay, let's, let's just move. Let's avoid the bats. Oh, there's another underground room. Oh my god, there's stuff everywhere. No, no. Oh man. Okay, we've got a torch down. We're good, we're good. Oh, wow. Okay, we're good. I think. <laughs> oh man. Okay, keeping my eyes peeled. I'll come back to that room in a second. Oh, hang on. Hang on. Can you guys see that? Can you see Mr. Life Crystal over there? Hey, hang on. He brought a friend. There's two life. Did we? Oh my god. We went right over the top of them. Oh. You mean they were there the whole time? Oh my god. <laughs> that is so crazy. Isn't it funny how often that happens? Like, you know. Oh, they're underwater. Maybe that's why I missed them too. Okay. 
Alright, let's get some more glow sticks. Glow sticks for everyone. Oh, okay. And kill Mr. Bat. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of that and that. And that. Alright, so let's pick up one. So, I think we were saying a life crystal for every quest. So, I've done at least ten because I got the angler hat. Um, did we do one today? Yeah, we've done one today. So, I can get up to a max of 220? Yeah, I think so. Beautiful. Alright, there we go. Lovely. Oh my gosh, there's mobs coming from everywhere. I guess our next step then, that we found some more life crystals... Oh, I don't know. I guess we can start making our way to them. I can't believe how close I was to them the whole time. <laughs> um, I guess we could start making a proper elevator, perhaps. Yeah, like right there. Um, all the way to the underworld is probably a good idea. Or we could finally explore the jungle because we haven't done that yet. Which I cannot believe it, to be honest. Um, it's usually one of the first things you do. Oh, wow. And look at this. We have been rewarded straight away by a sweet, sweet life crystal sitting in the honey. Oh, yeah. Let's use that bad boy straight up. Although we are not going that way. It's full of water. And our bunny really doesn't like uh, honey. Uh, we probably don't need the bunny in here, actually. Sorry, bunny. Oh, man. Okay, there's, there's like hornets everywhere. Okay, let's take him out. All right, we are on a mission. We are on a mission for life crystals. All right, I've got 15 seconds on my Splunker. No, it's about to run out! Ah! Oh, man, there's another one. There's another one. There's slimes everywhere. Why is it my... Oh, man. <laughs> oh, I was like, why isn't it hitting it? Oh, man. Okay, we've got another life crystal. This is good. Oh, but our Spelunker wore off. That's not so good. Okay, but that's okay. We can still have a look around, see what's going on. Oh, okay. I love exploring new areas. It's so fun. Uh, especially the first time you go there. It's like, ooh, what are we going to find? Oh, hmm. Okay, I, I want to open the ivy chest. Just just because, you know. Uh, oh, my God. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't die, don't die, don't die. Ah, I can't even see. <laughs> oh, that's like, the hitbox is so strange. Oh, it's a life crystal. <gasps> Quick, we mightn't die if we <laughs> use it. Oh, hey, it's a grubby. Oh, where's my, where's my net? Where's my net? Grubby, come back. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Okay. We would have died unless we used that life crystal. That's so funny. <laughs> uh, oh, it's a boomstick. Okay. Uh, we'll take the money. We'll take the recalls. Take the arrows. Take the honey dispenser. And we shall sell the boomstick. Sell it. Sell it. Sold. And let's heal. Okay, good. Oh, man. We're finding lots of life in here. This is awesome. Why didn't we explore this sooner? <gasps> is that another hive? Wow. Maybe. Let's throw some bombs in. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, oh. Just... No! <laughs> I did it again. I'm trying to throw it off the edge. Oh, okay. I, my boomstick isn't equipped anymore. Okay. Third time's the charm, right, guys? Alright, ready? Huh. Yeah, there we go. Hopefully that's not an actual... Is it an actual hive, or is it just like... Okay, I'm, I'm not quite sure. I really don't know. But let's let's make our way down. Oh, man. Whoa! <laughs> that's a big jump. Okay, yeah, it's boomstick time. Oh, okay, let's, let's have a little look around. Nah, that's a dead end. That's a hornet end. Okay. Oh, there's a... Oh, it meant... Oh, no! No, it was a boulder! <laughs> I don't like boulders. Oh, we haven't been hit by a boulder for a while. <laughs> then that's not a good thing. Like, that's a... No, that is a good thing. What am I saying? Okay, guys. Thanks, as always, for watching another episode of Felix the Fisherman. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe we got awesome items from those dungeon crates and went on a life crystal looting spree it was really really cool and it's interesting playing a fisherman like you don't need to explore underground as much so now that we've kind of got what we needed we're probably going to make our way uh, to the underworld and fight the wall of flesh next episode so that's going to be kind of cool next episode we're going to find yeah i reckon we can do it i think we can do it i'm pretty confident hopefully <laughs> uh... 
Just a quick announcement too, we've got a video coming out soon that has to do with our 100,000 subscriber special. You'll notice we're at 98 now, we're over 98,000, uh, which means the 100k is very close indeed. So this video is going to ask you to do something, and you can, you can get involved if you want, and uh, it'll help you learn a little bit more about me, uh, so it should be lots of fun, so stay tuned for that, and it is time, as always, for some shout outs and our first one today is from John Mill and he's asked me to say in a Gavin voice he's asked me to say Psh, helmets? Nah <laughs> Oh Gavin, Gavin you're just like Helena for getting your helmet too uh, Our next one is from Ben the Gamer YT and he's asked me to say in a Darth Vader voice <laughs> Why do I always laugh when I do this? <laughs> well I guess I'm laughing most of the time but <laughs> Give me the cookie or die. <laughs> oh, thanks, Ben. <laughs> Our next one is from Royal Skies. And have asked me saying this slimy voice. Feel my unbridled rage. <laughs> oh, there's nothing more terrified, <laughs> terrifying than an angry, furious slime. <laughs> oh, they're so cute. They're so cute. They're so cute. <laughs> Our next one is from James Butler. And have asked me saying a Felix voice. How many quests before I get the cookie rod? Yeah, that'd be cool. Bring on the cookie rod, I say. Bring it on. And our last one today is from Samundra B. And the boss me saying a Felix voice. She's on fire! Which I think is referring to when we were shooting fire arrows at the Queen Bee. Just to see if we could actually set her on fire. And yes, she can. For what it's worth, it doesn't do much damage to her, but you can set the Queen Bee on fire, which was kind of amusing. <laughs> uh, thanks for watching, guys. Click that like button if you've enjoyed the episode. Uh, the fishing challenge is about to get a lot harder as we approach hard mode. So if you've got any tips for me, uh, preparation for hard mode, let me know in the comments below. And uh, yeah, if you haven't subscribed, guys, click the little HD icon in the bottom right corner. Make sure you're part of our channel, ready for our big giveaway at 100,000 subscribers. Uh, if you're not sure, I usually give some games away as my way of saying thanks to my awesome subscribers. His most important part, as always, you will stay happy, and I'll see you soon. This is Happy Days, signing out. See ya. Alright, now let's find out where this lava is. Mr. Lava! <gasps> oh, goodness. Okay, we've got to heal off. Nice. Oh, he's about to go in his last form. Oh, what are we- No! 